From doctors conducting electroshock therapy on patients to forcing patients to have involuntary sex changes, we take a look at five doctors who carried out gruesome experiments on patients. Number 5. John Charles Cutler John Charles Cutler was a senior physician at the United States Public Health Service and was in charge of leading the Guatemala syphilis experiments. Only discovered in 2005, these experiments involved deliberately infecting prisoners, soldiers, and mental patients with sexually transmitted diseases without their knowledge or consent. The doctors would then test the use of penicillin in treating the diseases. The U.S. also hid the details of the human experimentation from the Guatemalan government, concealing the fact that more than 1,000 patients were infected and that many did not receive adequate medical attention. Number 4. Aubrey Levine Under the direction of Aubrey Levine, the Aversion Project was an apartheid government program that ran in South Africa during the 1970s. The project essentially saw hundreds of young gay men and women, predominantly from the armed forces, subjected to numerous gruesome experiments and techniques in order to try to cure them of their homosexuality. This included electroshock treatment, chemical castration, and even forced sex changes. This was all done without the consent of those involved, as they were simply forced into the program. Number 3. Marion Sims Marion Sims conducted a huge number of procedures and experiments on women in the 19th century. Despite his good intentions, Sims would carry out forced operations on women who were slaves, thus giving them no way to give informed consent. The women involved would face multiple operations and surgery without the aid of an aesthetic. While much of the data gathered from the experiments became useful to medicine, it is widely condemned because of the unethical way it was obtained and because a vulnerable section of society was treated so badly. Number 2. Wendell Johnson Wendell Johnson was responsible for a psychological experiment that has since been dubbed the Monster Study by psychologists because of its highly unethical treatment of participants. With the help of his graduate student, Mary Tudor, Wendell chose orphans from an Ohio orphanage and subjected them to various treatments in an attempt to prove his theory that stuttering was a learned behavior. This primarily involved giving some of the children severe negative feedback when they did not speak perfectly, while others were given positive feedback at all times. Number 1. Albert Kligman over the course of several months between 1965 and 1966, Albert Kligman carried out a number of forced procedures of prisoners in partnership with the U.S. Army and some pharmaceutical companies. Kligman's experiments involved injecting 75 different prisoners with varying doses of Agent Orange, a herbicide that the U.S. military wanted to use in warfare to test the effects it would have on humans. The caused chronic skin conditions for the prisoners, many of which continued to experience problems for long periods after the experiment had ended. The symptoms included cysts, pustules, and large sores appearing on the body. Check out our other videos and remember to hit the subscribe button for more videos every week.